everybody. So um, today, um, what I decided to do, I'm just going to show you how to use the how to use the two directional motorized booster, and um, I'm, we're going to talk about these two together. Coming up. How's it going, everyone? So welcome to the Jeremy's channel, and um, yeah, I'm going to show you how to use the parts of the booster. So here we go. All right. So um, for this booster, you need to um, unscrew these, and um, um, you're going to need like I think you need like two hands, but I think I can do it with one hand because I, n I never do that without uh, two without a hand. So let's see how well it will work. So I think this thing's going to open. Let's see. This is how you unscrew, and I'm going to show you how the batteries will go like that. So let me let me finish screwing up this one, and I'll be right back. All right, this is. All right, this is how you put the batteries in the in the two directional motorized booster. It takes C batteries, and um, it's not the only one you need to screw. But I found the other two. The these need to be unscrewed too, so you can um, put the battery in. And um, yeah, it works perfect. I'm gonna put the other way. All right, I'll let it on, and um, yeah. It works perfect. Let's see. This should go with this booster. This booster needs to screw one, which I don't know how to right screw because I sometimes some of my booster doesn't have a right screwdriver. So um yeah, this is how you open the screw out of the booster. This is how you use it together, huh? Like this. This is how you use it to open. This one needs two D batteries on this booster. This one needs four C batteries, which it's pretty much almost like a waste of money, like, which I will tell you. But, um, like me, I usually get these at the dollar store since they're cheaper, so I, do, I will recommend you get that at the dollar store, so yeah. This one has two D batteries. And yeah. This is how you do it, and um, yeah, you turn it on, like this needle, which I don't know has the best battery on this booster because, um, because, um, we usually use these on the dog and sometimes it doesn't work well, but I think it will work well for the day, let's see. And you put a screw back on. Then we'll take a look at this booster because I believe it uses the screws. I hope I can screw this back with one hand because this kind of just hits hard. Yeah, I can. So yeah, here it is together. Got it. And then um, this one, you'll need to do s two screws back like this two-directional motorized booster. Which I'm just going to show you how to use it because I know I haven't showed that in a long time. Try to find... Let me try this one. There we go, I got it. That the other one was hard. Start right here. Let's see if we can get this one. Got it. That was harder to open. Hmm. It will be easy with one. Oh, hold on. This is what's this is what it sucks when I try to open this thing. There we go, got it open. <laughs> there it is. This one has a great motor because I got that on Amazon the other day. So, yeah, let me turn off this booster. Then I will screw these back together. Which I'm going to screw these now and I'll be right back and I'll show you how to screw that back. Alright, uh, the booster measures 8.5 inches, like 9.5 inches on the booster. And, um, yeah, let me, let me see if this camera will focus. I don't know why this camera doesn't like to focus. Let me see, I'm going to put it somewhere back, let's see if it focuses, yeah, it's going to measure like 9 inches, I know y'all going to not going to see it, but yeah, 
Let's see, this one, we're going to screw this back together. You're going to screw it like this. And I'll put that in the wrong way. Whoops. And let's get the sco our handy dandy screwdriver. And um, you need to put it that way. You need to screw these two back. And um, yeah, this is how you use that two directional motorized booster and the other boosters with that. So yeah. And right. Okay. So just get that one. You need to get one more, and then um, that will be all for you. All right. But uh, before you uh, put you put these back, you want to make sure and test the booster first. First, excuse me. I can't even say the word first. You have to test the booster first and see if it's working with the batteries. If not, you're gonna have to change it, or maybe you put it the wrong way with the battery how it's supposed to go. So um, yeah. So anyways, I hope y'all enjoy this video enjoy this video about this booster review and um yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this i have a lot of fun making that video and i hope y'all appreciate it. bye for now